Oh Lord, it rained, it rained. Oh, good thing I closed my sunroof. What is going on, my modest? Dang, my hair is hella long. Anyways, I'm gonna cut it soon. Today, we have a fairly busy day. Right now, I'm headed over to LJ's house to pick up some banners. After that, I gotta go to AutoZone to find some wire brushes and spray paint, cause we're gonna be doing something. Don't worry, I'm not gonna blue ball y'all. But basically, I'm gonna be painting my brake calipers, but the lazy way. And by the lazy way, I mean you don't even have to take the calipers off the car. But let's take care of business first and head to LJ's, and then we'll go look for materials. Wait, 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 before we go, are you subscribed yet? Are you are? Cool, let's head out. Time to wake up the neighborhood. My car hasn't had AC for a couple weeks, so I've just always been driving with the windows down. It's a lot nicer, it's definitely a vibe because you can hear the, the turbo and the exhaust a lot more. Would you believe me if I said it's still summer right now? So we just finished meeting up with LJ. Got the banners right here, of course. I promise you, Modest, I have been listening to your request. And look, already, look, we, we, well, we hopping back on it. Now, I will say that these banners are not going to be put on the store until we get some new merch out, which is gonna be coming real soon. So this is only the first batch. We have another batch of banners coming in as well as restocks on logo decals and seven inch decals your boy got you well my modest since i took care of business early i just have one small request if you haven't already be sure to subscribe to the channel as well as follow the modism instagram and my instagram as well link in description anyways now that we took care of business let's go ahead to autozone or o'reilly's and just try to find our materials i'm not gonna lie type bars are so frequent around here okay we just pulled up to autozone right now this is the only thing i could find that i need so i'm gonna buy this here and then look at home depot for the other stuff got a civic right there Civic right there, Civic right there. That's Daily City for you. Yo, what? They make HPD side skirts for the 11 gen? That's sick. We are at our second location. That was a major L, they had nothing. All right, so I just pulled up to Sherwin Williams and if they don't have anything, luckily, there's no Riley's right across. And they had nothing, so O'Reilly it is. This might be my last, uh, my last attempt and if I don't find anything, I'm just gonna buy shit online. Please, don't let me down. So I didn't find any paint, but we found some brake cleaner and it's on sale for $4. Hey, that's a sick shot, no cap. Okay, I lied. I have one more location to check, which is Skyline. And the reason I'm checking it is because the O'Reilly's worker here told me they would probably have it. We're gonna get gold calipers soon. Dude, it's raining hella hard. And I'm wearing slippers. Well, that was a bust. We didn't get anything. No paint as of yet. That's not a problem. I gotta go home and do an assignment anyway. So tomorrow I have to finish Masters and see if they have it. Hopefully they do. Yo, it's crazy out there. I just did a 3.32 mile walk in the rain and I finished at 59 minutes and 59 seconds. That's crazy. Anyways, I figured since I'm down south, I'm gonna go stop by Lowe's and then head home. See if they have caliper paint. Oh, oh my God. All right, so we just got to Lowe's. Let's see if they have it. They got all this not caliper paint. I'm catching L's left and right today. Oh, hey yo. This Halloween section go crazy. Good morning, y'all. It's the next day. I just dropped Jenna off at school right now, but I am at Finish Master. Finish Master, located in South San Francisco. I have a feeling they'll have the paint. I'm really praying because this is the last place I can think of. 12 seconds later. Oh my God, they didn't have it. I gotta go online or something. He told me to check out um, O'Reilly's and Bayshore. But the thing is, they're probably not gonna have gold because gold is like a special color, I guess, but we'll buy it online. So guys, I'm all done with my exam. Now I'm gonna go drop off some orders as well as pick up some Chinese food. I ordered the VHT caliper paint online, so I don't know when it comes in, but whenever it does, we're gonna hop on that ASAP. Hey, what's up, cowboy? <laughs> it's a pretty nice day, as you can see. A lot better than yesterday. It's not raining anymore. Hey, OG whipping a Civic too. Got a nice little cruise going on. What's up, buddy? Just look at these clear blue skies. This boy loves sticking his head out the window. And he's over on El Camino Real, bussin'. Now we're just waiting on our food. The total came out to like 12.05 for some beef chow fun. And um, the lady was like, you have five cents? I, like, I got five cents in the car. And so right when I was about to walk out of the door, she was like, oh no, 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 it's okay, it's okay. It's just if you had it, but really good service. I highly recommend. Hey, let's get it, boy. We are back at home now, about to hop on call. You ready for this, bud? I'm starving, I haven't eaten all day. Woo! Check that bad boy out. I haven't had Chinese food in a fat minute, so I'm looking forward to this. But yeah, for sure, Andy's on El Camino, that's like one of my favorite places to go. <laughs> Look y'all, it's Jello. Oh yo, we got mayo. Today's the day I cut this all off. Just playing out all of it. This is gonna be the first time I'm using my own clippers, so I put together a little set. I just got this box at Target for like 10 bucks, but got a mirror, that was like eight bucks. This is full of scissors, thinning shears, and a bunch of combs and such. That was 13. This was like seven bucks from Amazon to neck duster. And I got two capes. It came with the other stuff I ordered. Let's see, bunch of uh, guards right here. 
smart cones, chargers. I'll be using these Nova Clippers. Also came with a trimmer. These are really sick. Yeah, that's basically all you need. I believe in total, everything came out to less than 150. So I'd say it's pretty worth it. All right, y'all, so I just finished my haircut. I am about to go pick up my sister right now. Honest review on all the haircutting stuff I bought. For less than $150, it's really good. The clipper and the trimmer, like I said, together, they're about $100 and it's really solid. Overall, I'd recommend. Getting some gas right now, and then I'm about to go hit the gym and drop some orders on. Last night, I ordered a camera on Facebook Marketplace. It's a Sony ZV-1, so hopefully by next vlog, we should be having better quality. Yo, check that 370 out. Not even 60. Well, I had to cut the gym session short because I found out this morning I have a mouse in my engine bay and uh, if I don't take care of that soon and he's still in there, he might chew up my wiring harness and that's gonna be expensive. Hey, but check out this F82 that parked next to me. Nice. I like it, I like it. Update on the mouse. I didn't see anything come out, but I'm pretty sure it's not in my car anymore. I professionally took care of it, you know. All right, let's get it. Time to check the damage. I'm gonna have to harass my engine a little bit. But my car's fine, none of the wires are all chewed up, so that's the important part. I don't know if you can guys see, but we have a R35 behind us, actually. <laughs> that's sick. Dude, Sawyer Camp is goaded. So the reason why I'm always here is because I have to knock out like three miles twice every single week for my PE class. And uh, this just makes it super easy, you know? It's just a nice walk through the forest and it's only one path. But anyway, it is a really sunny day today. Um, so this should be good. The vibes are immaculate. It's a motherfucking lizard. They got tons of stuff here like deer and frog, birds. That's about it. One reason why I really like this trail, no one behind me, no one in front of me. We made it back. We made it. That was a pleasant walk to start the day. And um, now I gotta go finish reading a book. The book in question is called Think and Grow Rich. I think I got it on sale for like eight bucks at Barnes and Nobles, but it's a really good read. Y'all don't know that is Pit Stop, the gas station and Boba place over there. Goaded. They usually have a sick lineup of Civics and other cars over here, but today it's kind of empty. Nice. Yo, this Honda Fit sounds nice. We are at Pacific Supermarket. They know me. I didn't know they had pork tocino here. I guess we're gonna have this. I think I'll cook up some garlic rice when I get home, maybe an egg too. I wasn't able to make any eggs because I'm actually out, but you know about that it's about to be buzzing of course coming milk tea right here anyways i gotta take care of some business so i will see you guys later good morning my modest today is the day as you can see my spray paint finally came in so we're gonna go ahead and start painting our calipers gold today before we do that of course you gotta jack up the car take off the wheels if y'all have this jack y'all know what's up man there's some good stuff of course of course gotta get our jack stand all right about that cool cool all right let's drop this set up the supplies you're gonna need for this is just these wire brushes brake cleaner and some caliper paint i got two cans of each i'm gonna be doing this the lazy way meaning i'm not gonna take the caliper off the car i'm not gonna have to bleed the brakes or anything literally all you do is use the wire brushes clean up the calipers force to use your brake cleaner and then after that just spray on so uh let's see how it turns out but of course safety is number one priority so since we're gonna be working with brake dust and spray paint i'm gonna be using a n95 mask and some goggles anyway we're gonna start off with the big brush i believe this is uh what is it brass or copper or something like that anyway you just want to start brushing all the brake dust off of it otherwise the paint's not going to stick at all just go all throughout just like brushing your teeth man this is so satisfying and of course after touch it up with a little brush to hit the areas that the big one couldn't cover these little edges over here 
little crevices. And this is the caliper all cleaned up. We brushed it off and sprayed some brake cleaner. I'm gonna go ahead and spray some brake cleaner on a paper towel and wipe it through just for little areas like that. But yeah, that's basically what they should look like. The front caliper is all clean. All we have to do is tape and mask off the areas that we don't wanna spray. These are the rears in comparison. As you can see, they're hella dirty. Then got these shiny gray ones, which will be gold soon. Both the rears and the front are clean. So now what you wanna do is tape off and mask off any of these um, hoses for your brake lining um, and basically anything that you don't want spray painted whatever color you're doing um, yeah just block that off i'm also going to put a little bit of tape in between here so we don't spray inside but yeah pretty simple as you can see we got everything masked up in a shitty manner it ain't pretty but it gets the job done anyway we're gonna start painting now i'm super hyped to see how this turns out Ooh, yo this is this is some nice paint. It's laying on hella nice. It's not even... Yeah, I didn't even color everything once yet, and it's... Oh, I think I should do... No, let's do three coats of this. But for now, since it's the first base coat, we're just gonna touch up general areas, and after that, we'll fill in the gaps. I wasn't able to find it in store, as you guys saw, so I ordered it online from r &E Paint Supply, and it arrived in about four or five days-ish. It's so hard to tell what's gold and silver when you look at it too long. <laughs> this is our first base coat, and um, we're just gonna speed up the process for the hair dryer. Now we're about to do the second coat. This has been drying for about 10 minutes with the assistance of a hair dryer. So uh, yeah, here we go. Honestly, if you really had to, one coat would be plenty because this paint, the coverage is amazing. And um, yeah, it doesn't splatter. Look at this interesting little nozzle they got. I actually sprayed myself with it because I didn't realize that little dot was the uh, nozzle. I know, I'm a dumbass. Right, time for coat number two on the fronts. So glad I went with gold. Gold is one of my favorite colors. So I just got the second coat done. This is how they're looking. They look super nice. One more coat and then it'll be completely done. Here are the rears, not too shabby. So before I do the third and final coat, I'm gonna let these sit for about 15 minutes at least. And in the meantime, I'm gonna go ahead and clean up the wheels so that when we slap them back on the car, it's gonna look real nice. Nothing too crazy. We're just using a wand and some of this. And of course, since the wheels are off of the car, it'll be super easy to clean them thoroughly. Of course, the magic sauce. If anyone's debating on painting their wheels, I'd say go for it. It's kind of hard to see right now because they're pretty dirty, but once I get these cleaned up, you'll see that there are imperfections on here. But, you know, after driving these for about half a year, you know, street damage is normal. Here's a little example, just a little chip, but look, that only is the paint. That's not even the metal. Me personally, I'd rather have to repaint than have an actual wheel, get it damaged, and be more pissed about that. This stuff is absolutely crazy. Look at that. One pass through, already making all the difference. Anyway, I'm gonna go clean up these wheels and uh, show you the end product. Right, y'all, wheels are all cleaned. And I think it's time to spray on that third and final coat. Last coat, here we go. Y'all know how it goes. Knock out the front. The third and final coat has been laid down, so we're gonna give this about 20 minutes to dry and then we'll unmask everything and toss in the wheels. So it's been about 20 minutes and we used the hair dryer. Um, we're starting to remove the masking tape, but wow, that came out amazing. 
dang behind face myself sometimes too. Here is the caliper with everything completely removed, but dang, this turned out a lot better than I expected. I wonder what it's gonna look like once I do a pad swap because it's no longer gonna be gold, it's just gonna be black right there. But wow, this looks pretty legit. I like it. Okay, we just completely unwrapped the fronts. They look insanely huge. I don't know why they look much bigger. They're starting to look like Brembo's actually. The gold really changes up the look. I think it looks really cool with the Monison logo. Check that out, bam. This is the car at ride height. Oh, my bad, you can't see it. But man, the fronts look insanely good. The rears look good too, it's just, you know, tiny caliper. Anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and knock out the other side for TikTok. Right, y'all, so I just finished the other side. I'm gonna go ahead and toss the wheels back on and then I will show you guys the end product. Boom, boom. here is the finished product. I think it came out really nicely. Clean. Like I said, the gold with the calipers matches the gold with the modazo. Sick. Dang, that VHT paint is something else. Really nice. Dude, when the wheel is turned, oh my god, that shit looks fresh. That West Brush squared out for a sex right there. Of course, we parked right there. Miata. And this really clean uh, Koki S14. Uh, and a Subi hatch. We got a little car meet going on. Anyway, y'all, today is your boy's birthday, so I'm out of meeting up with the boys right now. Gotta pick up Sean first, and then we gotta get some, gotta get some food stuff. So, uh, yeah, I'll take you with us. Got Sean right here. You gotta check out the brake calipers. Oh, he got the red modism too. Appreciate, man. I'm not even. I'm not even wearing That's this. That's the modism colors right there. White. You know what I'm saying, you know, bro? Look at look at the flow. Just look at the flow right here. That We're right there. You know what I'm saying? Well guys, this week has been absolutely fun. I'd say this was a pretty productive vlog. Got our brake calipers painted. Your boy turned 20. In the process, we also came up with some new merch designs. Behind the scenes, of course. And we have restocks on the way. So my mods, a lot of big things are coming very soon. And if you haven't already, be sure to follow the Instagram account. Linked in the description. But as always, thank you for tuning in. And if you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit the like. And if you're not already subscribed, what are you waiting for? Hit that sub! Let's try to hit 10k soon! Anyways, my mods, I will catch you guys next time.